For this experiment, I am showing the difference between series and parallel circuitry. Um, I am using a plug-in wire that is attached to these porcelain lamp holders that will hold the light bulbs. Um, the first setup, I have it in series. As you can see, it goes from the plug and each cord goes to the next holder all in one circuit. And once we have placed the light bulbs into each of these, they should all light up properly. As you can see, they all are currently lit. And if you will notice that they are all actually dim, and that is because the voltage that goes into each one is less than a split between them. And if you turn one of them, you'll see that they all go out. You can do this for any of the bulbs on the series. And then now I will set them up for a parallel. Okay, what I am doing here is I am setting up these lamp holders for a parallel. And we're connecting two wires to each one in and out. And once they're all connected, it will allow the circuit to travel through each one and back to the original starting point, and which will also allow each lamp to be lit. Now we have this all set up in a parallel, and as you can see, this last one does not need to be connected back to the original wire, and that should not affect the lights being lit up. Um, I'm going to go ahead and switch those over. As you can see, they are all lit up and they are much brighter than the series. And that is because while the voltage is now the same for each resistor, the current is going to be split between them. And what that means is we can go ahead and undo screw one and all the other lights will stay lit. And as you can see, they all stay lit. So in conclusion with a series, the voltage is split between the four bulbs, which will dim the bulbs. And if you turn unscrew one bulb, the, all the remaining bulbs will become unlit. Whereas in parallel, the voltage is the same throughout each bulb. And if you unscrew one, they all stay lit. The remaining ones stay lit.